Oh, it's right underneath us. Okay, the stronghold is right here, guys. And I know this is the... Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? Wait. What? Wait. What? Hey, what's up guys? Brandon here, and today I'm back with another Minecraft Pocket Edition video, and today guys, we are back on the realm for yet another episode. I think this is episode number 12, I, I think. I, I honestly have no clue what episode this is, so we're just going to guess that it's 12, although honestly, I've, I have no clue which one it is. Let me, let me check really quickly. Alrighty guys, so it's actually episode 13. I was wrong. Good thing I went and checked, but um, yeah. So today, guys, we're going to be doing something pretty cool. We're going to be going on a huge exploration. But before that, I just want you to go over some stuff that we did off camera. Now, last episode, if you guys remember, I think we did the prank on Fusion. And the episode before that was the Nether Adventure. So we've done quite a few collabs recently. So I thought it might be better to do a solo video. But um, something off camera that we did was actually we worked in here, if you guys notice. Inside the lake, it's a little bit different. We have like two areas that are now deep and th this thing in the middle as opposed to just the one that we used to have and that is because we have a secret entrance now it's a little bit difficult to get into just because of how redstone works but if i go over here this should oh okay this one's not working i don't know why realms does that sometimes where it just glitches for some reason i need to get some air but if i can tap that and then swim nope okay okay this isn't working and this is frustrating me. If you guys notice, the right one isn't working, and I don't know why. It's not because of a redstone issue. It was working earlier. It's like a realms issue, and I don't know. I don't know why it does that. But sometimes the redstone just doesn't work. Let's see if we can just swim up here. I can't even press the button. There we go. Okay, there we go, and we're in. Okay, I have to break this block and then replace it because it's not working for some reason. And actually, I'll probably need to. Yeah, it's the piston that's not working. So actually, if I just do this... Oh boy. Okay. Let me come up here, grab the piston. There we go! Okay, so now the piston's working and it should function completely fine. I don't know why it did that. Kinda took away from the grand entrance. But um, yeah, I made a secret base, guys. Or a secret entrance. Because the secret base is actually my regular base. If we just run up here, we will appear through the painting. So yeah. Yet another secret entrance. I believe Eris actually showcased this in his latest Realms episode. But, um, yeah. So that is one thing that we did off camera. And the other thing that we did was we worked on a lot of enchantments. So the first thing I got was a Soap Touch pick. Although, yeah, I got it, but it's, it's almost broken. So I'm going to toss that into my Ender Chest just so that I don't accidentally break it myself. So, yeah, so we got a lot of enchanting done, but we still have a lot more to go, and um, here's what I mean by that. So, we have a sword right now that has Fire Aspect 2, Sharpness 3, but I have some other things that I want to put on it. I have some other books that I combined, got it luckily, like, I got an Infinity Book, that was pretty cool, as well as a lot of this for a chest plate. So, what do I need to do? I think I'm going to work on the chest plate today, maybe? I don't, I'm not sure yet. Uh, yeah. I think, actually, no, we're going to... What do we want to do? We'll do the bow today. So it's just combining. That's all I really have left to do. I'm going to do most of the enchantment off camera and then just combine them on camera. So right now we have a power three bow. And what do we want to add to it? To make that power four is four. And to add infinity, it's four. So it's the same thing either way. So we're just going to make it power four right there. And then to make it power five is eight. And to add infinity was 11. Okay, we definitely should have done infinity first. But I think, oh boy, okay, 16 levels. We need 16 levels. We don't. We definitely don't have 16 levels. Okay, guess that's all we're gonna be doing for now. That was the enchantments. But um, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to doing a lot more with it because we have Power Four, Infinity One, as well as another Power Four book. And I'm actually gonna take these and head over to Eris's house just so I can enchant a little bit. But um, yeah, so I'm looking forward to that because I want completely decked out gear. We're gonna need it, guys. We're gonna need super OP gear for what we're going to be doing in the coming episodes. You guys will see what that is soon enough because I don't want to give away any spoilers. But if I just run over here, um, I think the bow is almost maxed out. We just need to combine it with power 5 or power 4 to get power 5. And then I think we just need flame and that'll be perfect. So we'll have flame, infinity, power. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of punch, honestly. 
like, I don't know, punch just makes it more difficult because it knocks the mob away when, like, you know, I just kind of want to shoot it. It's easier that way. So I'm not really a big fan of punch, so I'm not going to really be working towards a punch bow. As well as, um, I think we have enough to max out a sword and a chest plate, but we're going to need a lot more to do all the armor. I forgot my lapis. That's an issue. But lucky for us, we can just run right up here. This is why I'm so glad we set up the ender chest system. Okay, we have lapis right there. I should only need four because I think I'm only doing um I'm only gonna be doing level one enchantments, I think. If we could get some more. Oh, I'm low on battery. But uh, yeah, let's hop in here. See if we can get prot one, power one, prot one. Okay. Is there any way to make it level one though? Because I don't want to spend two levels. Hmm. I think that should work. Alright. Can I hello? Okay, there we go. No, still level two? Why are you still level two? Okay, if I place this. Now you should be level one. Oh, and we still get protection. That is very useful. Okay, and then I don't want to enchant the lapis. I want to enchant another book. Aqua Affinity. What does Aqua Affinity do again? Alrighty, so it seems like Aqua Affinity increases your mining speed underwater, which I'm kind of annoyed by that, honestly, on how slow you're underwater. So I'll take it. And we have sharpness one. I don't, I don't really want sharpness one, but uh, I think we're good. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry, Eris. But yeah, we'll just uh, break all of this, take my torches back, and uh, yeah, I think we're going to be good on the enchanting so far. So I'm just going to hop back over to my house, and we will get started with the actual episode. Oh wow, Eris built this. I didn't even notice that he had the place furnished, but this is pretty nice. Like, with the little jack-lantern things as the uh, as the lights, he has a cool little computer over here, uh, a window. What's in this chest? Absolutely nothing. He has a bed. Anything in this chest? As well as an elephant. And what's over here? Oh, he has like a little room behind the stairs. Interesting, I didn't even realize that Eris started to furnish the place. That's actually, that's actually pretty cool. And he has a little less than three over here. Okay, props to you, Eris. This place is actually looking pretty nice. Coming along really, really nicely. He has his chest room. And I think we can escape over here. Alrighty, guys. So we are back at the house. And let's grab what we need for this episode and get going. So I'm just going to place these over here along with the power book and the sharpness two book. Don't really need them. I need to eat. I always forget to do that. But um, yeah, so today, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be going on a great big exploration. And I need these things to come with me. So if you guys haven't figured it out already, the things that we are going to be doing on this exploration is we're going to be searching for a stronghold. Yeah, this is going to be a very fun episode. It's going to be the beginning of the end, I guess you could call it, because yeah, we want a stronghold so we can go to the end. What do you need for um these things again? I have Ender. I think you need blaze powder. So we're going to grab our blaze rods, which are in here. And let's see, blaze powder. And I think you just do this, right? Okay, good. So I'm going to assume that we're going to need maybe... Oh, wait, no, we need blaze powder. What am I doing? Not blaze rods. Okay, so we're going to do this. We're going to do that. Uh, We need some more of these. So let's go. I think we should just make a full stack maybe. Or we'll do two more. We'll do two more. But um, I think I'm going to take my blaze rods with me, just in case. But I think that's all we need, guys. So we're going to take this. We're going to put these over here. I have enough food. I have blocks. I have my emergency golden apple supply. Oh, we need a bucket of water. Actually, I think we're out of buckets. So yeah, guys, we are actually out of buckets. And that is actually because of a future project that we're going to be working on. I'll show you guys a little sneak peek to that. Let's look right in here. As you guys can see, this is our little sneak peek to the project that I'm going to be working on. If you guys can guess what it is, what it isn't, maybe you guys know. Let, let, let your guesses uh, down below in the comment section below. Tell me what you guys think it is. But yeah, I'm just going to get rid of this really fast. Hopefully it didn't. Okay, good. It didn't destroy the grass. Then I can just grab some water right over here. Still infinite source. Still infinite. And, uh... Yeah, we're just going to sleep really fast, and then we can get started with the journey. Also, my dogs are still, like, completely colored in. And Eris turned this one white. Yeah, he used to be yellow. So we're going to have to re-dye him in the morning. Do I have any yellow dye, actually? I do not. I don't think I do. Oh, well, I think it's just a flower, right? Like, we just take one of you, put you in a crafting table. Okay, good. Good. Okay, so we're going to get this. And then we're going to sleep on the orange bed, because it's my favorite bed, and I will see you guys in the morning. Whew. 
Alrighty, good morning guys, and let's get started with our journey. So, you, come here. We're gonna dye you yellow, and now we're going to head out. So guys, if you guys haven't noticed already, I already have the coordinates unlocker add-on activated and turned on. That way, once I do find this stronghold, I'll be able to write down the coordinates on where we are. And hopefully it does come with a end portal. I think all strongholds do, but I'm honestly not sure. But let's use you and see where you go. Okay, we need to go this way. Come on, don't break, don't break, don't break. Okay, good, it didn't break. Okay, also guys, this is Eris' sky base. He's working quite a lot on it. It goes above the clouds, which is actually pretty cool. And I don't know, it looks like a giant, like, fat key to me. If you guys know, like, the keys have, like, the circle area with, like, a long thing with, like, rectangles on the edge of it for the key itself. But like, this kind of looks like it. Like, if he took this part out a little bit more, it'd look like an actual key. But because that end part is so short, it just looks, like, really fat right now. It's pretty funny. But oh yeah, it's pretty cool. Props to Eris for that sky base. Honestly, Eris is working pretty hard on this server, not gonna lie. Like before, I used to be the only one who was doing like a bunch of work. But it seems like all the members are kind of, well not all the members, but a few of the members are picking up and doing a lot more. Like I think UI Stream did a couple episodes recently, Eris has been doing a lot. Haven't seen Hooper or Rage or Fusion, haven't seen Fusion in a while, and haven't seen Hooper or Rage recently, but hopefully they hop on. Well, Rage was, Rage was kind of recent, he joined us for the last episode, so that'll be pretty cool. But um yeah. Okay, let's see where this takes us. Watch like the stronghold is close by. That would be pretty cool. I don't want to journey thousands of blocks even though we have already. Okay, so that was try number two. I don't know how many uses these things have. I think they might have like a maximum of three. I honestly don't know. But um, yeah, hopefully. Oh my god, it's baby so- Oh, and it's a llama. Oh man, there are so many animals here. God, I keep forgetting though. Because like, if you guys didn't know, I used to have a llama in my house. But um, oh, another llama. Guys, there are two llamas here. Okay, I'm getting distracted though because, okay, if you guys didn't know, I used to have a llama in, his, in my house and um, yeah, he kind of disappeared for whatever reason. I don't know what happened. I'm assuming he just despawned. Oh, that's 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 a nice lag spike. Stupid baby zombie. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Jeez. That was... Ooh, Enderman. Give me Ender Pearl. Be useful. Give me Ender Pearl. Uh-oh, I'm lagging. Oh no. Okay, good, I got- He gave me an Ender Pro. Yes! Okay, but um, yeah, like I was saying, I used to have a llama in my house, but he is no longer with us. I don't know where he- Where did this thing go? Oh, I am blind. But yeah, he, um, he vanished. He is no longer with us, and I'm- I'm pretty sad about that. I don't know where he went, but like, I gave him a carpet and everything. He was blue, and he looked amazing, and I had him leashed to, um, the cobblestone wall right next to my, uh, redstone elevator. But yeah, he's gone now. And so now I really want more llamas because like, just imagine if we're traveling like this, but we have this like giant caravan, like that would be so cool. It's a giant caravan of llamas to carry our stuff. It's just kind of a problem if they start despawning. Okay, let's go. Where, where'd he go? Oh, I always seem to lose it whenever I first throw it, but oh, I haven't lost one yet. This is very good. This is very, very good. But um, yeah, let's continue on our journey. Oh, there's the swamp guys. Maybe we'll see a slime or two if we're lucky. Because I still need more slime balls, honestly. And I think it's gonna break. Oh, it didn't break. Awesome. Am I am I even correct? I swore these things, like, break every so often. Maybe they don't. Maybe I'm just crazy. You guys are probably like, thinking to yourself, what does he mean by break? Uh, that is, if they don't. They might. I'm, I'm pretty sure they do. And we have a village over there. I think you guys have seen this area already when I was searching for slimes that one time. Oh boy, I think the village is empty. I see a zombie villager in there. Did all of you die again? Because I feel like villagers naturally spawn here. But, oh yeah, you guys are... What happened to you? Oh, no, 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 no. Don't, don't touch him. Don't, 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 don't. Okay, see, I would jump... Oh wait, I'm smart. There we go. See, I would jump in there to like stop being on... No! Oh wow, okay, this village is like under attack. No! No! I am so sorry, Mr. Villager. I didn't do it. Stop it. Okay. Jeez, man. We save... Guys, it's okay. We save the village, even though there's a... Is there a spider in that house? Oh, you poor villagers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Run. Run away. Run away from all the... Mr. Zombie. Mr. Zombie, I'm gonna have to ask you to stop. I'm gonna have to ask you to stop. Stop it. Stop that. Stop it. Leave the poor villagers alone. They're just trying to live. Just trying to live. Okay. I think we saved this village. 
and also blew up half of it. But I didn't do that. That wasn't me. That was, um, they did it. I didn't do anything. Oh, great. Even further this way. Okay. What's over here? I think this is a flower forest biome, which I am pretty excited about because now I get to collect flowers. Hopefully I don't get two. Ooh, rose bushes. Guys, these look so nice on this texture pack. Like, honestly, I'm going to take a bunch of these back over me. Okie dokie. Now, where do we need to go? I'm just going to try and get to a clear vantage point. What is... Does anyone else see what happened to this tree? Look at this. Whoa. That is... That is weird. That is very weird. It's like half broken. Like, look at that, guys. That's weird. Alrighty, guys. We have to continue heading uh, this way. I think I've been this way before. Um, when we did the first ocean monument, I think. Although I'm not too sure. But yeah, alrighty. Got you up there. Oh, that was a that was a lag spike. Hey. Okay, let's keep going. Let's continue to move. We have pumpkins over here. Nice. Oh yeah, I think right over here. That was the way to the ocean monument. If you guys see, we have like pumpkin, 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 pumpkin. I just decided to place pumpkins because it looked like somewhat natural and is better than just cobblestone blocks being placed randomly around the world. Ooh, more rose bushes. Don't mind if I do. Okay, but um, yeah, I think I think I placed those. I'm not too sure though. Alrighty, gotta keep going this way. Okay, we have to go more diagonal. Four white horses, wow. You all look really pretty, but I don't have a saddle with me, so there's nothing I can really do. I should probably start a horse shop, honestly. Let me know down in the comments if you guys want me to start a horse shop, because I have definitely enough saddles to do so. So, like, should I sell the horses with the saddle, or should I just sell the saddles? I don't, I don't know. I don't really know how horses work, like, too well with, like, the speed and jump factors and all that kind of stuff. I'm not, I'm not really too sure about that, but... Dang it, we have to continue on this way. Ooh, wolves. I think I have enough doggies, though. I can just, like, breed my new doggies if if I want more wolves, because traveling to this biome just to get wolves is a little bit too much. Although, I think there's actually one closer to home, right next to Eris' house. So, yeah, maybe I'll get more uh, more dogs in an episode. We'll see. Before we enter the biome, I'm going to throw this one more time. Oh, yeah, I threw two. That was a mistake. Oh, that one broke. I told you guys they break told you but dang it i didn't want it to break now i have one less okay i gotta be careful though because i need um i want enough of these so that i can get to the stronghold write down the coordinates of the stronghold and then um like fill in the portal itself that way like you know if i wanted to go to the end anytime i wanted i could but um yeah if you guys are wondering by the way the end fight probably will not be in the next episode just because it's going to take a while to first stockpile gear and stuff because i'm pretty sure not everyone's ready although people do seem to have a lot of diamonds but like especially like rage and fusion they're not really on that much so i doubt they are like prepared to fight the ender dragon because i mean i i'm probably the person who's on the server the most in all honesty like eris is probably a close second along with carrie and ui stream but i mean even we're not ready for the dragon yet we still have a lot of enchanting to do things like that so um yeah the ender dragon fight itself will probably be in a couple episodes and definitely won't be like immediately after this one. But yeah, where'd, where'd that go? You're up here, aren't you? Aha, I found you, you're not escaping from me. But it seems to be more this way, through the trees. I just saw that skeleton spawn, no thank you. No, oh, I keep running out of hunger and oh, that was a lag spike. See, I feel like it lags every time it generates chunks, but that one seemed to be a bigger lag spike than usual. So I'm hoping that's because it was generating a stronghold because I really, really want the stronghold like, soon? I'm getting tired of running in this, like, direction. Okay, go. Oh! Oh! Okay. Okay, we're getting somewhat close. No, it broke! Oh, goodness. Okay. Okay, we're getting closer, because we've gone enough in that direction, now we just need to go more in this direction. Ugh. I need to get onto the trees, guys. This is not working. Okay. I'm now on the trees. Where did you go? Where? Huh? Wait, did anyone else lose where the... What? Oh, I keep losing the eyes of Ender. This isn't good. 
Okay. Okay. Third tries the charm. Where did you go? Oh. 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 Oh, it's right underneath us. Okay, the stronghold is right here, guys. And I know this is the... Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? Wait. What? Wait. What? Wait a minute. Hold on just a second here. Hold. What? Wait, 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 wait. We're not even in an ocean biome. How is this possible? What? Okay, so we have an ocean monument, and underneath this ocean monument is our stronghold. Oh my god. Wait, how is this even possible? How? What? I am so conf- What? Is this even possible, guys? Like, let me know down below because this is a river biome. I'm pretty sure ocean monuments only spawn in oceans and deep oceans. But, what? Um. Okay. Okay, um. I, I, I don't know what to say, guys. I'm, I'm seriously, like, out of loss for words right now, but I think I'm gonna have to end the episode off right there. So, yeah, um, check that out. That was, that was unexpected. That was... I don't know what to say. Okay. But yeah. Um, I hope you guys did enjoy. That was... What? What? Is this even possible? Was it like a chunk glitch or something? What? There's an actual giant ocean monument down there, guys. Like, and there's a stronghold underneath this ocean monument. What? I don't... I don't, I don't know what to say, guys. I'm so confused. I've never even thought this was possible to be generated in Minecraft. But, um, yeah. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure to smash that like button down below. Smash the like button for this epic find that we've gotten. Like, oh my... I don't even know how... I, I don't know what to say, guys. That is... That's insane. That is absolutely insane. But, yeah, like I said, smash that like button and make sure to subscribe. I am back from my trip, guys. So, um, yeah, we got a couple IRL videos going out. Pretty soon we have one where I explore the cruise ship and two vlogs most likely. So if you guys are excited and pumped for that, make sure to smash that like button again. And uh, yeah, if you guys are new, don't forget to subscribe and click that bell to turn on post notifications. That way you guys will always be notified of an upload. But yeah, that was about it. I will see you guys.